probably recognize this outfit from the previous video that I uploaded but I did film a couple of videos in the same day so I hope you apologize I hope you apologize I hope you forgive me <laughs> it's super late so it's very late I'm looking like a grease ball I just finished napping and saying like I know I look like a grease ball but I do look like a grease ball like at first I was like no it's just a highlight but girl please it's late I'm looking like a grease ball, but it's all good because I love you guys and I know you love me. So let's go ahead and jump into this video. <laughs> so I did upload a couple of higher end hauls on my channel the last couple of weeks because of course Sephora had their VIB sale and a bunch of us were like hoarding onto gift cards and just waiting for that sale and the sale hit took us by storm and we just got everything that we could get so I told you guys in that video that I was going to balance it out with drugstore hauls so I wanted to show you a drugstore haul today so this is a bunch of stuff that Joey actually picked up for me from Walgreens you guys already know that Joey loves to make up shop for me now a lot of people are just like what girl why why is he like that or what did you have to do to get him like that honestly Joey just loves, loves, loves to make me happy. I'm just like, why did you spend the money? Or why did you use that? Or why, why did you do that? <laughs> or why did you use your money? Joey has like specific money that he takes out for like his lunch or just like for the, you know, for the week because he goes out to work. And, um, you know, I want to make sure that he's eating and stuff like that. So he has money that he puts aside. But this man never uses the money for himself. He always holds on to it. And will use it for me or he will use it for the kids it's just the kind of person that he is he's just he's amazing i cannot say it any more time anyway he went to walgreens he actually went to walgreens a couple of trips and i've been holding on to this stuff forever i wasn't sure when i was going to be able to do the haul and then i had all the sephora stuff so i wanted to do the sephora haul like around the vib sale because everybody was uploading it around the same time so everybody was enjoying those videos so I've been holding on to this for a minute and I wanted to show you guys what I got. So this is actually an accumulation of a couple trips that he took to Walgreens and we just kind of put it in one bag. Okay, so this bag looks a hot mess because I'm like trying to get into it and trying to see what he got in here. Um, there's a couple of things from Walgreens in here and then there's a couple things from the dollar store. I hope that that like sound of the bag doesn't annoy you because sometimes it can bother me also i'm sorry if the lighting like i hate those i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry like 50,000 i'm sorry i hope that the lighting in the video doesn't change too much but you guys already know the deal and in a couple of months this room is gonna be banging my videos will be on point in the very very near future but thank you guys for sticking with me as long as you have you are the real mvp so the first thing that joey picked up for me and if I picked up an item, I'll tell you it was me, but for the majority of the video, it's going to be Joey picked up for me. Okay, so the first thing that he picked up, and I was trying to, like, not blind you, but my ring light and this, like, iridescent box is not going to help your eyeballs. So I apologize for that, but I'm going to make this as quick as possible. So the first thing that we got is the Fergie Center Stage Eye Collection. They had this for, like, a Christmas. It was, like, around Christmas time. I'm not sure if Walgreens still has this. But if they still do and you're looking for something to get for someone, maybe a teenager who is getting into makeup or who is allowed to wear makeup and you want to get them a nice palette, this is a real nice palette. I love, love, love Wet n Wild shadows. Now, I haven't dipped into this palette yet, so I don't know if these shadows are as buttery and smooth as my other Wet n Wild shadows, but the Fergie line specifically has never let me down when it comes to eyeshadows, so I don't think that this is gonna be an issue either. So this set came with a eyeshadow palette, two eyeliners, an eyeshadow brush, and a mascara. It was $10 and I also had 15% off, so I was able to get it for like 8 bucks and change, which is a great deal. Well, Joey got it. So Joey actually saw this and FaceTimed me and was like, yo, do you want this set? I know you don't have this. Do you want it? And I was just like, yeah, boy. Walgreens has a section where they have a bunch of palettes for $1. So you have to know that if you're paying a dollar, you're going to get what you pay for. So they're not going to be top of the line 
Too Faced or, you know, uh, Urban Decay shadows. They're not going to be those type of buttery smooth shadows. But for $1 at Walgreens, these were pretty so good. The first one he bought me is the number two, which is the Smoky palette. And again, it was a dollar. And then the next one he got me is this one. It's the number th three. And it just says number three on it. Twinkle Twinkle 5 Eyeshadow. Um, this one was a dollar too. I will say that these, like the ones that came in the squares, were much more pigmented and buttery than these. They're both a dollar, but if you have to pick between like the squares and like the circle ones, I would go with the squares. These were way more pigmented. I will show you really quickly the pigmentation on these, um, but they are pretty pigmented. The only thing I don't like about these, like the only con I have about these is opening them. Maybe it's just a week, but <laughs> okay. So this is what it looks like when you open it up. And I will go ahead and swatch a couple of them and that's the swatches. And they feel pretty nice and smooth and buttery. Um, I don't know how well that is picking up on camera. It's probably not going to pick up too well on camera. Especially that one that I just swatched there because that is a transition color that I swatched there. So you're not really going to see that one. But the green is really pretty. And this one right here is very pretty again i don't think that the camera is going to pick it up too well especially with these big old like behemoth arms but these are very very buttery so if i had to choose between the circles and the squares i would definitely go with the squares a dollar each come on so that's eight palettes for one dollar and i can do any type of drugstore makeup look just using these palettes alone so i was pretty excited about that and happy to add these to my collection because these give me a lot more variety when i do my drugstore makeup look then of course you know we love shopping at the dollar tree because we love getting things for a dollar and i love wet and wild and i love milani from the dollar store so anytime i find the milani liquid lipsticks i always pick these up I love these. These are like liquid lip colors or lip stains, but these are actually pretty nice. They're more of a gloss, so they don't really dry matte or they're not like a liquid lipstick like I'm wearing today, but they still dry to a really nice finish and I love these and they do last pretty long and I also love the smell of these. These smell like candy. I got three of the Milani liquid colors from the Dollar Tree. Then of course you guys know I love shadows, so Joey picked me up some more of these colors. In the last haul, I showed you guys this one, but it was like a copper color, and I did a look with it, and I was so, so surprised at how pigmented those shadows were. They were super pigmented, so Joey wanted to make sure I had all of them in my collection, so he picked up these two for me as well <laughs> from the dollar store. Then, of course, you guys know how much I love Wet n Wild shadows, and I love creme brulee. When I put the primer down on my lid, I just want to make sure that I set it with an eyeshadow, and I use the creme brulee to set that. It is the perfect color because it's pretty much the color of my skin. So when I layer it over the eyeshadow base, it just it just really helps to set that and that way when I put other shadows on top of it it just blends like a dream so I love this one and they actually only had one left so I made sure I have one already but I wanted a backup so Joey got me this one and then they also had this really pretty berry color at the Dollar Tree we just picked up some mouthwash because we are like the biggest breath people I mean it's so funny too because Joey and I can watch a show and we will be watching it together and both of us will be like she looks like her breath stinks mm, he looks like his breath stinks like we just have an issue with breath and flossing and making sure that we're you know drinking mouthwash our teeth are not the best I'm going to tell you that right now we've been on medications for years him and I and a lot of the medications we've been on have caused issues like dry mouth and cracking of our teeth so I am not saying that I have perfect teeth I am Far from having perfect teeth and if you follow me then you guys know that I don't have perfect teeth. I have issues with my teeth. I need to get a lot of my teeth fixed. I'm not ashamed of it. It's just a byproduct of being on a lot of medications because of my kidney and with Joey he's on a lot of medications because of his brain disease. So medications have side effects and some of those side effects are dry mouth and so on and so forth. So when it comes to like perfect teeth or like missing teeth and stuff like of course Joey and I have those issues because of our health. But when it comes to our hygiene, we're huge on hygiene. So we always make sure to pick these up. And these are a dollar at the Dollar Tree. But let me tell you something. Rinse with this and your mouth will be on fire. This just, it doesn't taste like the ones from like Walmart. This one tastes like so, so, so strong. I don't know. I just love this one from the Dollar Tree. So we always pick this one up. So we picked up another one because you can never have too many. You always got to have fresh breath. Okay. 
<laughs> and then the last thing that we got from the Dollar Tree are these lipsticks from Wet n Wild. They really haven't been so huge on lipstick just because my lips are shaped so funky. Can't really tell sometimes, but sometimes you can tell. It just depends. So we picked but up four of these liquid, liquid. We picked up four of these lipsticks from Wet n Wild. But that is my Dollar Tree and Walgreens haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I told you guys that I will not only have high-end hauls on my channel, but I'm also gonna have drugstore hauls. I'll probably have way more drugstore hauls than I have higher-end hauls just because. So yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I really can't wait to put all this makeup to use and do get readies with, get readies, and do get ready with me videos. And I know a lot of you guys have been talking about doing makeup tutorials for hooded eyes, which I have. So just stay tuned because those videos are coming. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>